welcome back to my channel if you're new to the to this channel you are most definitely welcome and if you are returning you are welcome hi guys i was just rambling on how long i've disappeared on this old youtube thing but if you just want to make everything perfect have this have that have all of that before you start filming then it's just gonna take forever so guys sorry guys, about the lateness and enjoy the video watching me transform Peace. myself from this to looking like a barbie then keep on watching hi guys so i'm going to i'm just doing a simple makeup tutorial for today and i've done my skin prep and all but it's been over like 30 minutes or so so i'm just going to moisturize again and i'm using the omari code breaker and esther moisturizer yeah and hydrate this moisturizer can serve as a primer so it's two in one moisturizer and a primer i'm not going to prime because and I'm not going anywhere because this is a good primer and I've already laid my um, my brows I just used some air wax or air gel anyone anyone you want to call it just regular air gel that's what I use to so just lay my brows skin work you know just a tutu, just a Makeup video for maybe a girl's night out or a date, anyone, anyone really. This there is going to work for any outing, but you know, without brows because my brows is not well groomed and for all of that. So, I'm just going to wait a little bit for this to dry. While I wait for that to dry, I will bring out my foundation. I've been using two foundation. Zikel foundation. This has SPF 30 and Melanie Conceal Plus Perfect Foundation. And this is 15 Mahogany. I think this is the last shade. And this is, I think, Cacao. Yes, this is Cacao. I don't know if this is a lash shade, but for me, I think this is a lash shade. So I'm going to use, I don't even know which is darker. I think this Zikel is darker. So I'm going to use this Zikel around where I would normally contour and this all over the rest of my face. So let me try out. Let me see which is darker first. Oh, this Zikel is darker. Can you even see it in my hand? This is a, um, What's it called? Melania and this is Ezekiel. The Ezekiel is, is it is darker. Hmm. Yeah, the Ezekiel is darker. But I can definitely use any of it. See, this one has actually even disappeared. I can use any of it. I feel like if I use this zika, it would just be a little bit darker, just a tinty bit darker. I don't know if you can see it very well. I'm going to use this my Vika Bell brush. It's from the brush set in NK4. And then I'll work in sections because zika actually dries out really fast. Really, really fast. And I don't want to use a lot of foundation, if that makes sense. So now I'm using the What's it called? What's this one here? Yeah. Milani. I 
and as you can see I'm not using much like to use a lot of foundation just enough to cover up for what's it called i'm going to go back with my uh, beauty by dd blending swatch just to make sure everything is all blended It used to feel like this is like just being extra, just caramel. But you know, you don't want to be cut off fresh. Don't, don't be cut off fresh. That's not cute. So I'm going in with my in my skin new band concealer. This is light, and this is in the shade four zero four five. I guess I can go this light. I guess can definitely be this light. Can even go higher. And it's not even it's not much. So when you apply your concealer, you let it dry a little bit. Unless you are using like a very, very, very dry concealer. There's some concealers that are very, very dry. Like Zikel. Yeah, Zikel products are just very dry adventure all those concealers like that are very very dry so i'm going to let this sit a bit okay guys so just going to blend it with my beauty sponge wow <laughs> did i wait for that long Okay, 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 yeah, he's blending. <laughs> Just thought it was blended for a second. So go back to the back of your beauty blender. Just to blend out all the the edges so that it doesn't look like oh And look at how I'm blending it. I'm blending it from the outer corner. Just to spread out, out a little bit. So that I don't have much product around this edge. And I'm just going to blend only the outer corner. Leaving the inner corner. So that I can have a lot of coverage. Around that side. Back to the back of your beauty blender. The back of your beauty blender is your friend. Don't neglect it, okay? I'm going to use what is on the beauty blender for my chin. And it's just a just need a little bit of the chin. Yeah. Not even much good at that. Okay, what I'm going to do next is blush using a cream blush. And I'm using my Ganesta, is it Ganesta or um, Ivy, Ivy Y Bella? Okay, yeah, that's flawless. <laughs> Sorry, flawless Antonia. 
um, lipstick palette. So I'm going to mix this orange and this orange and this, these two shades together. For my blush. Blending it with my foundation brush. This is actually the first time I'm using this lipstick palette as a blush. And I'm not mad at it at all. Yeah, it's giving what it's supposed to be giving. Okay, so now let's blend. And now I'm blending it up to meet the nose eyeline, but not really meeting it either, just leaving it to be space. And I'm going to set it immediately. So I know the way my mouth is open and the way I was looking, I look like a, I can bind you, but I don't know how I'm going to like stretch the skin under my eye. That's why I was, that's why I always do like this actually. Then when I peel off um, the powder. I just like to like you know dust off the excess even use my hand sometimes so that the excess can disappear make sure you blend it this is setting not baking so i'll have to like you know blend everything and i'll make sure it is well blended And the powder that I use to set is the Vianch Cosmetics. This Vianch Cosmetics, guys, this looks like a... Um, what is it called? What's the name of the... This thing again. It looks like... How CME. If you know how CME, then you know how this Vianch looks like. It looks like copy. And I'm setting the rest of my face with my... Beauty powder palette. I'm using the shade chocolate and bronze. Right? Is it bronze? I can't even see the name of this. Guys, when I get the name, I'll just put it down in the comment section. Make sure you set it everywhere. Set, contour, the blush, and everything to work. You can get them back. So I'm using the darker shade there. That is ebony, I think, in the palette to contour using the same brush because this brush is pretty small
Did I say the name of this brush? This brush is NK3. I don't know if I remember to say the name. We're looking good, are we? Really? So guys, for blush, I'm going to be using my Mude Beauty eyeshadow palette. I'm using the shade Jailbreaker. Most always. Okay, and I will use this one too. This is just a random palette. And I'm going to mix this shade and this shade. These two together. To get the first color of blush that I use. I think I use a lot on this side, but you can never use a lot of brush. That's it. Brush actually disappears. I don't know where they are going, but they do disappear. to bake with the same powder Okay, so I just used concealer on my lid and then set it with powder. What I'm going to do next is using a black eyeliner. This is the Marlboro eyeliner under my eye. Using the smudginity bit. Try to like ring it out. Using my ankle brush, like.
so I'm just taking some products from the pencil on my angle brush because the products actually like creamy to matte and they look funny. <laughs> this but is only yeah, for the reverse. Kind of good at the end. I think this is my first time doing it. Okay, so guys, this is the finished look of my face bead, and I went with a boo boo outfit and a scarf so that I'll just be giving it a rich anti vibes. Yeah, I'm so sorry, guys, my camera kind of like went off. There was no <clears throat> what's it called space on my phone again so i had to like finish everything off camera and then come back plus the nepal to be light this is nigeria <laughs> so till next time bye